It's not what's out there that makes the difference. It's what's in here. It is what you want to do. If you have an understanding that this is a, <coughs> this is a matter of survival for women and you're interested in, in, the, in helping women survive, then this is for you. It is not for you if it is not an inner calling. It just isn't. It doesn't work that way. It, it's not the technical component. It's not the intellectual stimulation. Abortion services are a hard issue. It's a hard issue. And if you have a willing heart to help women in catastrophic situations, you could be an abortion provider. You could qualify and have a satisfactory life. <coughs> There are probably more physicians who get shot working in emergency rooms than there are abortion clinics. There are all sorts of dangers. Postal workers, firemen, police officers, everything has a risk to it. I would prefer personally to have a challenging, stimulating, emotionally and spiritually rewarding uh, career that is short rather than have a long one that is filled with ho-hum, mundane, mediocrity, feeling as if you don't make any difference to people. You will make a difference in women's lives. If being important to, to patients, if <clears throat> making a significant difference in women's lives is important to you, having a career as an abortion provider will be an emotionally gratifying and tremendously stimulating uh, occupation for you. If it's something that you sort of select intellectually, it'll turn to salt in your mouth real quick and you'll be gone.